We all have our favorite Olympic sports. Among the most popular, of course, is track and field. There's gymnastics and swimming. But what about canoe, slalom, racing, and this year, women's boxing? I'm Jennifer Jolly. In today's Tech's Appeal, a look at some of the lesser known Olympic events. Weird or wonderful, I'll let you be the judge. There are 32 different sports on the Olympic program at the 2012 London Games. Of course, we all know Michael Phelps, a few of those track stars, and we love to watch those high-flying twists, turns, and oh-so-dramatic tumbles that keep us glued to our screens throughout. But what about trampoline? Did you know that this is an Olympic event with medals and everything? What do you think? Think I could work up some mad skills for 2016? Hoppa! Not so much. Well, good thing there's still archery. Fans of the Hunger Games will be excited to check out this sport where the athletes shoot at targets about this big from nearly an entire football field away. Seriously, you can't give me a grown up arrow? <laughs> there's also badminton and ping pong, excuse me, table tennis, and this one, race walking. How can you not poke a little fun at this? I know, to each his own, these are obviously feats of athleticism that require tremendous skill, grace, and grit, and deserve a little respect. But BMX cycling? Well, you gotta admit, it's adrenaline-fueled and appealing to the X Games generation when these athletes tackle those jumps, bumps, and sharp corners as fast as they can ride. But those races only last about 40 seconds, so if you blink, you'll miss all the good stuff. So I'm reading the rules about which sports make it into the games, and according to the IOC, among other rules, the sport first has to be recognized and then widely practiced around the world. Hmm. <laughs> For more fun, random, and entertaining Olympic news, be sure to check out Tekka.com. I'm Jennifer Jolly, and this is Tech's Appeal.